What is going on guys and gals, ladies and laddies, welcome back to more Monster Sanctuary. In the last one, we got this fight with Will, and I've been trying it for a little while. I grind it up, as you can clearly see, my guys are a little stronger now. And I just accidentally beat it on the grind. I was like, eh, let me attempt it again, and just rinsed him. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. So, sorry about that. It wasn't anything different than what I normally do. It was Zenitsu... Who did I use? Zenitsu, Peter, Pieter, and uh, Skloops. It's just the boys are Shippo. It's not Skloops. Huh. That was a good fight, wasn't it? Remember when we first met in the Blue Caves? We were both just Keeper Aspirants, while Julia and Leonard were Keeper Lancers. Uh, now I'm a Keeper Ranger, and I thought I've grown so much, but I think you've grown way more than I have. Don't discourage yourself. Your spectral wolf would be proud to see you right now, Will. Thank you, but Rizu shows me how, uh, how much better I can still become. It is true, but because of your drive, I pronounce you worthy of the title of a spectral keeper. You should come with us. Thank you. It means a lot to me. Uh, I'll go ahead to the uh, door to the abandoned tower then. Uh, it should just be right over there. Like, I'll, I'll just go over there. Yeah, you do that, Will. Oh god, look at all these nerds. Ha! <laughs> you don't have your lion anymore, nerd. Oh, there she is, everyone. Oh yeah, and also I have the uh, the Old World Tycoon Dapper outfit now. So, I'm no longer, like, a super warrior. I'm just a uh, dapper lady. We've been waiting for you. Eric already told us about everything. Uh, can't open the gate to the abandoned tower without all four spectral familiars, can we? Can we? Uh, I'm just not sure if we still count as Spectral Keepers if we lost our Spectral Familiars. Quit your yammering. Each one of us has made it here. Through the most dangerous areas in the sanctuary. You literally followed me into every dangerous area and got through. We're the ones who are willing to do anything it takes to save the sanctuary. If not us, do you think that scoundrel who stole our Familiars through trickery and subterfuge deserves to be called a Spectral Keeper? Nay, I refuse to believe that. Surely nobody will deny that we remain the true Spectral Keepers of the Sanctuary. Huh, maybe you're right. Well, let's try to open the gate so we can find out for sure. We need that key of power you found in the Underworld to open it. Alright. Insert the key of power now. We are ready to face the monsters of the Abandoned Tower. And then he just gets... He opens the gate and then just gets chomped on. Uh, oh god what's his name Deus Patra we really did it we opened the gate to the abandoned tower so we're still spectral keepers in spirit I suppose spectral keepers finally I found you I risked my hide getting here what happened you're the jail keeper aren't you that I am Although I didn't do a good job being one. Here's what happened. I was watching over those two alchemists you had caught, as is my duty. But suddenly, it was like a smoke bomb exploded and enveloped the entire jail and its surrounding areas. Before I even had a chance to call for help, I heard the alchemist's cell opening and the alchemist escaping. At first, I tried to find that Keeper Dragoon Eric, but nobody seems to know where he is. Last time we saw him was when the gate to the underworld was opened. Strange, I hope he's alright. He's evil. He's, uh, Mard... Mard... Marduk. Whatever his name is. Marguerite. Uh, you did a good job informing us. Uh, please keep looking for Eric and let him know that we opened the abandoned tower. Abandoned tower? Alright, I'll do my best. Let me just catch my breath for a moment. I guess we'll be seeing those two alchemists again in the abandoned tower. How? We just opened the door. So unless they have a secret entrance in, no idea. Seems like just about the entire order of alchemists is waiting for us. No matter, our battle plan stays the same. Let's try to stick close to each other as, uh, as we explore the tower. Follow me. Yeah, stick close, and they run off. This is it. If we defeat those alchemists, you, Will, Leonard, and Julia will become legends among the keepers of the monster sanctuary. 
Let's do our best to go down as heroes in the history books. Why don't games, like, if I fail this mission, do you think they just, like, give me a bad ending and they're just like, yep, nope, Keeper Sanctuary, take it over by Alchemist. It was a terrible time. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh, they're Reapers. Thanatos, weak to magic, strong against physical. Okay. We're just going to do this. Uh, we're going to do safe cast so everybody gets a little bit of a little bit of buffage, a little bit of power, and then firestorm. Start burning and weakening people. It's fine. We can we can heal that. It's fine. We get rid of those. We just Put dots. Put dots on enemies. Oh, they didn't get affected by anything. That's rude. Get poisoned. No, oh, you didn't get poisoned. That's not good. Get weakened. Yeah, we spread weakness. We proliferated. Debuffs. Everybody got debuffs. Everybody's weaker. Everybody's dying. Yay. Cyclone. Doesn't do anything extra, but it's it's an ability. Um, let's do... Mud Cannon. Heal. Sonic Wave. Oh, he doesn't have any debuffs on him. What the heck? Firestorm. Burn him. Get rid of him. Alright. Let's see what we got in here. Yep, I figured it was something like that. Keep Pieter out here. What the heck? That's a furry if I've ever seen one. Satsune. Sure. Um, you, you, you. Power buff. Firestorm. Ice storm. That's fine. That's also fine. And she steals buffs. Incredibly rude. But you get coded in debuffs. What are you gonna do? You are a healer. She steals buffs and is a healer. Just start busting her up. Oh gosh. Oh, so they all steal buffs. Yeah, no. Deep freeze. That's fine. That's also fine. Her, and now it's just that last guy. All oh, right, magic. Monster Bell. 14,000 experience is not bad. Uh, big rock guy. A switch stone. Let's 
I've been like kind of tempted to like switch stone some of my guys. Oh, this fight's gonna suck, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Uh, we need just debuff central. Throw debuffs on them. Let's see how well we do. Who knows, we might even just die from it. There we go. Healing wave, so we survive a little bit. I don't know what that was, but it's a little spooky. Everybody can safe cast. Sonic wave. Uh, healing wave just to keep everybody alive because I'm not taking the risk. And my shielder is dead. Not ideal. And they're stealing my buffs. Yeah, never mind. Debuff squad was not the play. Let's go ahead and just retreat. And let's jump right back into the battle. You, you, you. Power. Shields. Sonic wave for weakness. All right, Mass Restore, Ice Storm, Firestorm. Only one guy got burned. We got to apply weakness and all the all the debuffs. Make sure everybody's healed up. Make sure all of them are debuffed. Even more debuffs. Now and she mass restores. Make sure they're always getting hurt by something extra. I dislike greatly that they steal buffs. Like, and it's not like it's one specific character. It seems like all of them are doing it. Come on, come on. Just more AoE damaging spells. We just gotta keep hitting them and dealing damage. They can stack so many things. Ice shield, just in case. Burns. Maybe they get more burns. Yeah, every time they steal a, a buff. I need... I'm trying to think if I had anybody who, when they put on a debuff, they had a chance to uh, remove a buff. But I can't think if any of my people have that. Sonic Wave. Alright, that's one damage dealer down. We just gotta keep getting rid of these buffs. Uh, no, we need a uh, power buff just to make sure everybody's good. Hit you. And deal some extra damage. These Sutsunes are jerks. 
buff stealing furry ladies. That's all they are. Alright, there's only one left. Freeze. Almost. We almost got her down. More blasts. There we go. I mean, she might be a better healer than uh, than Shippo. Like, it might be beneficial to get her on the squad. Does he just make it so that you can steal buffs from enemies? Like, that'd be super helpful. And if it works for everybody on the squad, even doubly better. Um, you don't have fire. No. Who has fire? You do. Just looking for the first guy that can spit fire. Ooh. Right, we just keep going. Um, what the heck kind of fantasy game RPG squad is that? We got a unicorn, a furry, and a and death. No, not happening. Not about it. Don't know what I'm trying to do here, but I gotta go. We go this way. Oh, end of freaking Bird of Paradise. Sure. What is this, Magic the Gathering? Get out of here. Mushroom. Alright, Will, what do you need? Crazy to think that it was only thanks to those champion monsters that we could catch up with Leonard and Julia. The alchemist caused a lot of damage, but it also allowed us to rise to the challenge. Also, we probably never would have ended up exploring the abandoned tower. This is a historic moment for sure. I'm glad that I could be a part of this adventure, alongside you and the others. Thank you for everything. This sounds like the end of the game. Like, this sounds like... Like, oh, you're going to reminisce with all your friends, and all of them are going to tell you things about what's going on, and you're going to, you know, look at them and be like, oh, my friends, my good, dear friends, how we are the best of friends. Then I jump from the rafters. Um... Staff plus five. You know what? I need to... Mm, when applying a buff, 50% chance that a debuff is removed. I mean, it's the opposite of what I was thinking, but... We got it. When applying a debuff, triggers an additional 30% damage hit. Hmm... Boost your attack rating. Boost crit damage. Boost defense. You can receive additional stacks, and defense from equipment is increased. Cool. Alright, let's climb all the way back to the tower. They're just kind of like, hey, did you get enough things to get all of this other stuff? Like, we'll just let you. If you have the guy that unlocks it, you can just unlock it. Mm. 
So if I had started with the eagle instead, If I had started with the eagle, there's a chance that I would have just had a... Uh... Yep, and that opened this one down here. I didn't even know there was one down here, but I guessed there was. Oh, right. Get rid of the frog so I have flight powers. But yeah, if I had started with, like, Spectral Eagle, would the Spectral Eagle have allowed me to, uh... to fly right from the start? Like, would that have mitigated the need for flight at the very beginning? It's an interesting idea. Oh, it's this loser. Alright, fine, I'll talk to you. Just between you and me, I feel afraid. Not afraid of losing against another one of the alchemists, but more afraid of facing my brother again. I just wish that things hadn't gone the way they did. Never mind. There's nothing else to do now, but press on and face our destiny. Yeah, sure. Whatever, loser. You suck. Whatever this way. Come on, you can't just leave like tower scaling sections. Fine, I'll go this way. Oh, it's this loser. Hey, have you noticed anything strange so far about the abandoned tower? We've already covered more than half the tower. I've had a look ahead at the next couple of rooms, and still, none of us have found any trace of the alchemist so far. The entire place seems to be, well, abandoned. Do we actually know for sure that Marduk and the other alchemists are here? Where do we know that from? You know it from a most reliable source. Me. Alstain's alchemist. I knew it. You were actually following us, weren't you? You have our deepest gratitude for opening up this abandoned tower for us. You were using us all along? That's right. All it took was a simple lie. Yeah, 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 yeah. Marta isn't in the tower, is he? He never was. But where has he been for all this time? Nobody's seen him in the sanctuary for hundreds of years. Wrong. It's been hundreds of years since I've worn my true face. It's Eric. The Dragoon. What a shock. No, you're not really Eric. You figured it out. The man you've been calling Eric, whom you thought to be a Keeper Dragoon, was actually our leader, Marduk. But how? Eric was an accomplished monster keeper who has been known to the sanctuary for his entire life. 23 years ago, I ambushed Eric while he was traveling in the magma chamber. Given the territory, it was easy to dispose of his body. I then used an ancient forbidden alchemical method to take on his appearance and voice. Just as I had done with many other monster keepers for the last 300 years. The best mask is the one that nobody suspects. The frozen oracle called you an undying devil. We see now that she wasn't exaggerating at all. As a spectral familiar, one of the immortal guardians of the sanctuary, I swear to you that you will pay for what you've done. You can't stop us now. In fact, you've only helped us so far. Alstains, Valalar, Chimes, take care of these two. Zosimos, come with me. Just punch him in the dick as he's running past you, Joe. Pop! Hey, not so fast. Don't go running off now. <laughs> I'm itching for a fight against another Spectral Keeper. We won't let you pass without a fight either. Isn't that right, Alstains? Huh? Oh, that's right. This time, you'll have to face both of us at the same time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, how I've been waiting for this moment. Let's deal with these two quickly. We don't know what the true goal of Marduk, uh, Marduk are. But we have to stop. What? 
What? Oh, great. Uh, well, let's just put out this squad to start. Get a power buff. And let's get ice shields so everybody stays alive a little bit. It's fine, we can remove those. That's a lot of debuffs. We can't remove that many debuffs that quickly. Um, can you stop? It's incredibly rude. I need you to cease and desist. Oh my lord. Debuffs. Debuffs on everybody. Just holy crap. Yeah, we're gonna get melted by just... Yep. Mm, not great. Uh, we need shields. Thunderstrike. Yes. Hit them back. Okay, remove debuffs. At least a couple of them. Alright, we at least take out one of them. We can take this guy out. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Just get... Get debuffs. Just debuff the enemy. Just weaken the enemy enough so that we can survive. Get rid of the unicorn. Or... I don't know. It's, it is a unicorn. It's just a dark unicorn. But it's not a bicorn. Spectral flame. Stabs. Okay, he removes buffs from dealing damage and stuff. Alright, we just keep putting down debuffs on people. Let's get rid of their damage dealer. Okay. It's not too bad. Keep hitting their damage dealer and blinding him. As long as we keep blinding him, then he won't be able to do as much damage. Because he'll be constantly trying to repair his eyes. Okay. Two enemies gone. Okay, this is this this fight's going well. Let's get rid of him. And let's start blinding this guy. Whirlwind, chilling wind, lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. I don't know if they just made them weaker or my strategy was just better this time. How could this happen? All stains. I had the perfect strategy. Hey, it's not my fault. I did my part perfectly. Hey, looks like we missed the action. Did you defeat both of them, Riza? We did, but that's not important right now. We've been deceived. Over 20 years ago, Marduk took on the appearance and identity of Eric, and he used us to open up the abandoned tower. The alchemists weren't waiting in the tower. They just followed us inside. Unbelievable. Marduk used our trust against us 
No way. We're children and somebody used our trust against us? Who'd have thunk it? Bad news. I'm still trying to process how it happened, but I, lo I also lost against Chuck. How? That means he's got my familiar now. That makes it three. A ruthless villain of a brother. I'm sorry for your loss, Julia. I know exactly how it feels. No matter. We need a new plan. Will, you and I should put these two alchemists away again. Once we've done that, we'll come back here as fast as possible. Sounds good. Let's go. And I'll scout ahead again. It's not like I have much else to lose now anyway. Don't worry. I know we'll all get our spectral familiars back. I still have mine. The alchemists don't have anywhere to run now. All right. Yeah. She's right. All we can do now is to keep follow uh, is to keep following the path uh, to the top of the tower. No doubt we'll have to face chimes along the way as well. Don't worry about me. I know that you're a remarkable monster keeper. Our journey together has shown me that. If there's anyone who can defeat him, it's you. Thanks, bud. Um, I'm going to call this one there. Uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>